Hello, this is the ninth tutorial on how to make Minecraft in Flash. Now I've been getting quite a few requests on how to make um, biomes, different biomes. So I guess I'll do that today. So far all we have right now is just a big forest biome. Trees here and there and that's pretty much it. So what I'm going to do now is make a desert biome. So. I'm going to make a new new block. It's going to be sand, so let's make it yellow. There we are. In the script, just write sand, SD. That should be good enough. And make the frame label sand. Okay, that's not good enough to make a new biome. Let's go into the script of the main main frame. We have the script. Now, when we start generating the, generating the world, we want to define what kind of biomes we have. So we'll make a variable named biomes. Biomes equals, and we'll write an array. The first variable or the first value in biomes will make forest, what we have now. The second value in biomes will be desert. Make a desert. Now, if we want to make, if we want to pick a random of one of those, pick a random between forest and desert, then we can say biomes or biome. So we're picking one biome, and then we go into biomes, do a bracket biome equals biomes, then we'll pick a random number out of how many possible choices there are. Biomes.length. So we pick a random biome. And we can just test it by tracing the biome. And we'll see we'll get a random one between forest and desert, which we got forest. We can do it again. This time we got forest again. Oh, that time we got desert. Okay. So now we have it where we have a biome chooser. Okay, so what, right here we want to make it so that instead of dirt and trees, we'll just have sand. So if the biome is a forest, if biome equals equals forest, then do everything there. If it isn't a forest, else... Instead of dirt, which we'll copy that over here, we'll do sand. And now we need to cop do the same thing down here where it makes dirt underground. We'll just say if biome equals equals forest, and we'll put dirt there. Else if, bi oops. Else if biome equals desert, do sand, so I'll copy that over here. Sand. And it would be better to have, instead of just else, we'll have else if biome equals equals desert here. Because we want it so we can add more biomes if we wanted. Okay. Now we can say, see this time we got desert biome. It's just a bunch of sand everywhere. Now if we reload the world. Oh, we got desert again. And again. <laughs> this time we got a forest with trees. So that's great. We, we have a nice biome generator. But that's not good enough. One world just with either a forest or desert. We need to make it change from forest to desert or back. So I'll make it happen every 30, 40 blocks to change from a forest to a desert or a desert to a forest. So, right here we can add the script once it gets to the top of the world. Okay, um, over here we, we can say um, time until next biome equals random number from 30 to 40, about. Now every x value, every 
row will subtract one for the time until the next biome. Time until next biome minus minus. Now if the time until next biome is up, so if time until next biome is less than or equal to zero, then we change the biome. So all we need to do is copy that. We'll copy both of these so we can reset the time until next biome. And awesome, we have a biome switcher now. So if we load our world, we can see eventually, looks like this is a double forest. Looks like this is just a really big forest right now. There we go. Ah, oh, there we go. There's some desert now. <laughs> right at the border. But there's some desert, and now it changes biomes every so often. Oh, we started in a desert, goes into a forest. And now that can set up the possibilities to make cactuses and maybe even just new biomes that you make up yourself maybe another on earth biome so you can mess around with that and see what you can make like down here and um, we can say instead of rock or coal if it's the nether biome we can make it have nether rack or something and that is how you make different biomes.